guys, welcome back to Burns' Math Club. Today we'll be learning how to multiply a monomial and a trinomial. A monomial is a real number, a variable, or a product of a real number and one or more variables with whole number exponents. Here we have our monomial, which is negative 4x. So this is a product of a real number, which is negative 4, times the variable x. So this is a monomial because it is a single term. A trinomial is basically a sum of three monomials, so it's three terms. So here we have 3x squared plus 7x minus 12 as our trinomial. So we will be learning how to multiply this monomial times this trinomial. So what you basically do when you're multiplying a monomial and a trinomial is that you're distributing the monomial to each of the terms in the trinomial. So that's why I have the parentheses around the trinomial. Because remember, whenever you have parentheses around the terms, that means you're multiplying. So you have negative 4x times this trinomial. So let's go ahead and distribute the negative 4x to each of the terms. So when you're distributing, you're going to multiply negative 4x times 3x squared first. So we're going to multiply negative 4x times 3x squared. And once again, remember, parentheses means that you're multiplying. So negative 4 times positive 3 is going to give you negative 12. And x times x squared is going to give you x cubed, or x to the power of 3. Because remember, whenever you're multiplying exponents, you're actually adding the powers. So you have x to the power of 1 and x to the power of 2, and when you multiply them, you get x to the power of 3, or x cubed. So now we've done this, so now let's go ahead and move on and distribute the negative 4x to the positive 7x. So when we distribute this, we're going to get negative 4x times positive 7x. So negative 4 times positive 7 is negative 28, x, negative 28, and then x times x gives you x squared, because remember, you're adding the power of the exponent. So x, plus, x to the power of 1 times x to the power of 1 gives you x squared, or x to the power of 2. Now let's go ahead and distribute the negative 4x to the negative 12. So negative 4x times negative 12. Negative 4 times negative 12 gives you positive 48, because remember, a negative times a negative is always a positive. And we get our x, because our second term, which is negative 12, is a constant. So it's basically a real number, so it doesn't have a variable with it. So we have negative 4x times negative 12, which gives us positive 48x. So at the end, we are left with our product, which is negative 12x cubed minus 28x squared plus 48x. And this is the product when you multiply negative 4x, which is the monomial, times the trinomial, 3x squared plus 7x minus 12. So this is it for this video. Thank you for watching, and we will see you guys in our next video. Bye.